Hello everyone, welcome to this video. In this video, let's look at another question which is also application based from group theory. So here in the question they are saying we need to determine the symmetry group of the outer shell of the cross section of HIV, human immunodeficiency virus, which is shown below. So an HI, uh, uh, HIV virus looks something like this. So here you can very clearly see if you look at the outer shell of this virus, which is this one, right? Uh, the one which is marked between these two lines, right? So this is symmetrical in nature. You can very clearly see that it is circular in shape, right? So they are now saying what would be the symmetry group of this outer shell. So let's have a look here. To find the symmetry group of this outer shell of cross section, we let's label all of the, them uh, starting from one. So let's see how many such uh, designs are available to us, correct? So when we label them, it contains 28 equally spaced spokes coming out of it, correct? Okay. So that means this virus is left right symmetric. So that means it would resemble the shape of 28 gun as we have done in the case of bottle cap having 22 gun uh, having symmetry which is uh, which resembles 22 gun symmetry right here we have 28 such spokes so 28 gun would be the symmetry group for this hence the symmetry group for the outer shell of the cross section of the virus HIV is D28 so that means it would have 28 as the reflection symmetries and 28 as the rotation symmetries what would be the reflections here the reflections would be obtained let me show you here if you start from this one you would have it like this passing through 15, 14 correct uh, it's not right it would pass through 14 what about 2 it would pass through 15 and we can mark it like this another thing which we can mark here is like this the line which is passing through in between them correct so here also we would have such line then we would have this blue line over here passing through it correct and we keep on doing like this so we would have in total 28 such symmetry uh, across these lines this virus the outer shell would be symmetrical in nature hence we would have such symmetry right moreover for rotation we would have 360 right we would have 360 divided by this 28 whatever is the angle that angle uh, by that angle if we rotate this virus the outer shell would have the same symmetry hence it uh, it is the symmetry group for the outer shell of this hiv virus is d28 the dihedral group d28 so i hope you understood this question well well that is it for this video thank you for watching